Hey, what's up, guys? It's Coach Ashraf Mela. Um, many people have been asking me about how to build a bigger, stronger chest. Um, I wanted to kind of like go through four major movements that, that, that are going to help you to improve your chest and maximize all the gains when it comes to getting big. Okay. Number one is the flat bench. Everybody knows the flat bench. Uh, uh, we see it a lot in bodybuilding and powerlifting. Number two is the incline press. That's very, very important to build the upper part of the chest. Number three, the decline, which you know helps to target the lower part of the chest. And number four is the uh, uh, chest flies, which you know you can either use with the dumbbells, you can use that you know with the cables, or just simply the machine. Okay. Now remember, most people find you know. Uh, having a bigger chest attractive in both men and women. In fact, you know, there's a study which shows, you know, uh, women are more attracted to men with a smaller waist to chest ratio. So we're going to go through these four major movements and let's go. Many variations come around, so it depends what you're going to do. So you either, we're either going to use a barbell or dumbbell or just even free weight. Okay. But when it comes to when it comes to getting a better chest, we're gonna look at the flat bench first. Number one is the flat bench. You gotta know how to move your bar straight to the chest and explode all the way up. But remember, you need to warm up the chest, move it with the bar, simply the bar, before you load it with the weight. Okay? Why? You need to play it safe as always. So uh, how you hold the bar. Use the neutral grip, you know, go all the way down. You, you want to try to make sure the bar touches your chest. Why? It's used in powerlifting. That's how they count the rep, okay? And that's how you break down muscle tissues, okay? Let the bar touch the chest or one inch from the chest, then you explode all the way up. So you want to target the part of the chest, the bigger part of the chest. Number two, we look at the incline. The incline, you want to target the upper part of the chest. That's very, very important, okay? Uh, slightly hold the bar in the same movement, neutral grip. Make sure you go all the way down, full range of motion. Like I said, full range of motion. You need to slightly arch your back, you know, uh, so that you can maximize out all the, the, the movements and the, the muscles you're trying to use. Uh, number three is the decline. The decline, you're targeting the lower part of the chest. So when you go down, take the bar all the way down slightly below the chest and explode all the way up remember to squeeze throughout the movement squeeze throughout the movement you don't want to rush when it comes to the decline why most people do that and they end up putting the bar straight to their throat that is very very dangerous now number four is the chest flies you can use dumbbells you can use uh, uh you can use the cables or just simply the machine now in this video we're using the machine why a beginner, an intermediate, or anybody can use it. So when it comes to the uh, uh, chest flies, you want to target the inner part of the chest as you're seeing right now. Okay, you remember, you want to squeeze as well as, you know, you go all the way out. Now, remember keeping your shoulders as well as, you know, uh, your arms parallel. Okay, now, uh, those are the four major movements when it comes to building a bigger chest. Uh, I appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. I'll see you in the next video.